everyone, how are you today? Lucia here from Laughing With An Accent. Hope you're doing amazing. Today I have a brand new subscription box to our channel and that is Grazing Goddess uh, Charcuterie. Is that how you say it? Charcuterie? Charcuterie? Uh, it, this is a company that does charcuterie, charcuterie boards and items and they send out a box every month if you want to subscribe for $59.99 and they send five to six items, anything from cheese and meats, chocolate and more to set up a nice charcuterie uh, board if you want to host or just for yourself and especially with valentine's day coming up that might be a really good idea to set up something at home instead of going out so uh, when you get it it says perishable open immediately so you have to put it straight in your fridge oh my goodness look at that when we open it up i have a card and it says bridget the celtic goddess of inspired wisdom a patron of warfare goddess of the earth and domesticity of family life it is said that it by repeating the genealogy of Bridget, you will be all we will always be protected. So I guess that's the theme this month. And here we have all the items. There looks like there's about eight items, so I'm excited. And I will do a little bit of a flat lay and show you how I set everything up. I do have a board, it's not super big, but we'll see what I can do. Here we have their card, and it says uh, check out uh, check out our subscription, sign up to receive a box of goodies at your doorstep. And you can use GG sub 20 uh, to get 10% uh, off your first box, $10 off. But if I have a code for me, I'll give it to you as well. So here we have the goodies. I love the green. Okay, so the first thing I have are by um, Ify's Homemade Lightly Sweet Biscuits and Oat Cake are original. And this looks so yummy. Crisp buttery layers of toasted oats with a hint of salt. Oh my goodness, that looks amazing. Already, off to the start. Ooh, Artisan Crackers uh, by Le Panzanella. La Panzanella. These look so yummy. Ooh, there's a card here. It says, thank you for supporting us. Oh, cute. Okay, then we have, ooh. Some goodies that come wrapped in here and we have some meat by Koro uncured salami there's oh cocoa cinnamon chipotle oh mole oh there's certain stew there's mole oh that sounds really interesting and classic so excited to try these love salami that is something that um, I eat all the time because I'm on keto ish then we have a fruit pate. Oh my gosh. Pear hazelnut? What? That sounds amazing. By Oregon Growers. Mmm. That sounds so good. It's like a jelly. And you know you can put jelly in your cheese as well. Oh my gosh. It's so good. Okay. So let's see what we have here. Because I'm super intrigued. Ooh. Comes in a nice ice pack. Okay, so there's ice packs, and she did tell me that they last a few days, but uh, to put them in the fridge, obviously, as soon as possible. We have a Briar Rose Creamery Cheese, and this is Damona, semi-firm cow's milk cheese. Ooh, sounds yummy, and I'll read the description as well. We have some cheese sticks, like flagship. Ooh, Beecher's Handmade Cheese. Nom nom. What is this? Oh my gosh. This is marinated labne brush creek creamery. Handmade soft cheese. Oh my gosh. And it's in olive oil and it has some capers and oh my goodness, that sounds amazing. Ooh, cocoa truffle bar. Honey Mama's original Dutch. Oh my gosh, these truffle bars sound so yummy. And I think that is it. Okay, so let me put everything aside and we will uh, recap with the uh, card here. We have Brush Creek Creamery, the marinated labne, marinated in olive oil and peppercorns, fresh herbs and dried red peppers, 
the award-winning Mediterranean soft cheese is made by straining fresh cow's milk yogurt through cheesecloth and then flavoring it with fresh garlic, parsley, and salt before shaping it into balls and dropping into the olive oil marinade. It sounds amazing. Then we have the Panzanella Original Crocantini. Create a perfect supplement to flavorful cheeses, tapenades, and charcuterie. Charcuterie, tell me if I'm saying it wrong. With just a touch of coarse sea salt, these crisp light crackers enhance any accompaniment. Let's say it right. Then we have the Coro pre sliced salami in classic and mole. Classic salami honors timeless old world flavors but adds a new spin with garlic and a hint of ginger. Mole salami has was inspired by the magical fusion of sweet, savor, and spicy flavors from the kitchens of Mexico. I tried mole um, and it was delicious. I thought chocolate in food, like no, but it was so, so good. Uh, Beecher's, the flagship cheese sticks. Uh, 15 months of aging nurtures the flavor and texture of flagship to perfection. With hints of browned butter and caramel, flagship is a versatile cheese that is balanced, dense, and creamy. Sounds so good. Briar Rose Damona, semi-soft cow's milk cheese with a supple paste and a few eyes. Flavor is approachable with hints of butter toast, warm popcorn, savory fudge, tootsie roll, green olives, and panna cotta. Think Havarti means classic Tom or Tommy. Melty goodness, pasteurized age eight plus weeks. Then we have the hazelnut fruit pate by Oregon Growers. Oregon Growers fruit pate distill the pure essence of our locally grown fruits. Their bright flavor and subtle sweetness is the perfect counterpoint to artisan cheese. The pure hazelnut fruit pate is made from whole fruit with no additives and preservatives and are 100% natural and gluten free. Then we have the Ify homemade oat cake. This sounds so good too. These lightly sweet classic tea biscuits are unlike any you've tasted. A fourth generation family recipe, the original oat cakes are crisp and buttery with layers of toasted oaks and a hint of salt. Enjoy oat cakes on their own or pair them with your favorite jam, nut butter, or virtually any cheese from blue to brie. And then we have the original Dutch bar by Honey Mama's Elegant Cocoa Honey Love. Honey Mama's original bar is made with rich, dark, silky cocoa and joke vanilla to create an incredibly decadent treat. This sounds amazing. Um, it sounds like the perfect box for someone that wants to try and that loves cheese and meats like me. <laughs> or someone that does keto, for example, because this is very keto friendly. I think except the fruit pate um, or these, you have to check if oh, about that. But everything else, well, the crackers, I guess. Anyway, forget about the keto part, but I think it's really awesome. And I love this idea for a day night at home, uh, especially now that we can go places, you set this up and it's so pretty. You can even open it as a couple or, you know, with your friends. If you want to do like a game night with some couple of your friends that you see all the time, <laughs> beware of COVID, obviously. But let's set this up and I will show you a little video with music on how I set it up or some pictures. I don't know how I'm going to do it yet, but I do want to show you how I set everything up. My husband's going to love this too. He will love it. So what do you guys think about this description? Let me know down below. If I have a code that says my name, um, please use that one. I don't get anything out of it, but I just like to know that you know if you if i if i send you i like them to know and if not gg sub 20 gets you 20 dollars off so that is a pretty hefty discount um but again i love to hear your thoughts this was a grazing goddess oh i get it now there's usually a goddess maybe feature every month maybe that's why so um yeah i thought it was a really good box so what do you guys think let me know down in the comments below thank you so so much for joining me on another video please give it a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you on my next one stay tuned to see how i set everything up and how i eat it maybe <laughs> bye